Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Dave from Apple Unlimited. Uh, if you're like me, you're dying to find out what is going to work, what is not going to work with the brand new iOS 13 developer beta one. So that's why I'm filming this video so we can find out together what will work and what will not work. That light is a little distracting, so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of it real quick. All right, so some of these I have tried already, some of them I have not tried. So together we will go through and pick out the most popular apps and see what's gonna work and what is not gonna work. All right, so first things first, messages. Definitely works, and it works very well. I've had no problems with that so far. This, by the way, is the iPhone XS Max. Um, everything that is from Apple, for example, like the photos and stuff like that, is going to work um, because it's from Apple. So really we need to focus on the ones that are not from Apple, um, like the Bank of America app. I already tried that one. That one works. I remember a few betas ago that one didn't work and I had to use my iPad <laughs> to pay bills <laughs> for a while until it got fixed, which is funny. But <clears throat> the Bank of America app does work. Um, obviously Facebook works. I have tried that already. Um, one thing, it's not in dark mode yet, but it will be. Um, I'm running dark mode right now. Um, Instagram does work. I've had no crashes so far, which is great. No crashes. Um, I have not tried Twitter. I don't even know if Twitter works on this phone. I haven't used it in years, probably years, hmm, whatever. Um, cool, so, <laughs> Cody's the guy that I got the, the install files from, cool. Um, Outlook, Outlook is an email, that works, that's one of the ones I was worried about. I also have, let's see, regular mail. I don't even know who I have. Gmail, I guess. Yahoo Mail works. Um, so all three of my emails work. That's good. Podcasts. Obviously from Apple, so it's going to work. But it just looks really cool. I love the new look of it. Um, I did already try the Bluetooth in my car. Which again, I was worried about that. That one works. Uh, I have a Toyota Camry 2014. I don't think that matters as much as just the fact that Bluetooth does work, so that's awesome. Uh, the phone, I haven't really tried, but I'm sure that works. That looks really cool, too. Um, <clears throat> the camera, you can, you can edit a whole bunch of stuff. You can edit videos and pictures way more than you could before, which that is also a very, very cool feature. Um, hmm. I haven't seen this yet. That's pretty sweet. The remote, I use that sometimes for the Apple TV. Um, let's see what else works. And what doesn't. Uh, Dropbox, I have not tried this yet. That works. Hasn't crashed. Cool. Mm, I have just a lot of weird stuff on here. That I haven't really used in a long time. So YouTube works. I have not tried eBay yet. eBay works. Uh, Netflix. Hasn't crashed, so I'm assuming it works. Let's see for sure. If it plays. Yep. <laughs> yep, it works. Cool. Uh, speed test. Let's try a speed test. Let's see what my speed is at. 11 is, for the ping, is pretty normal. That's pretty low, but I have multiple streams going right now. I'm not worried about that, really. Um, what else? Ooh, Waze. Waze is my favorite for driving, and okay, 
It's looking like it's trying to work. It didn't work earlier, but I was worried about that. Yeah, it might work. It's looking a little buggy. A little buggy. It wouldn't even do this earlier. Um, so, ways may or may not work properly, based upon that. Uh, another one I was worried about is time hop because <clears throat> I've almost got a thousand days. And if that one all of a sudden didn't work, that would suck. Not almost a thousand, but 933, that's pretty good. Okay. Nope. Okay, what else can we try? Um, Apple Watch. Of course that works. Um, I haven't downloaded the, the beta of the watch, but that's fine. Um, notes is a little different. Cool. I feel like the more the more I iOS is that they come out with, the more stable they are once they come out. Because I remember a few years ago, it was just really awful. <laughs> and this one seems livable on my daily driver. Um, Find My is new. I've already played with that on Catalina. What else can I try? Vimeo. See if that loads. Um, looking like it is. I have a lot of weird stuff on here because my daughter... Um, I want to try Lightroom. That's one that I'm worried about because I use it all the time. It looks like it's working. Cool. That's good news. What else? And Light this is one that I paid for. I use sometimes. And that one. I don't have any problems either. Huh. I know some of my games aren't being supported anymore, so that's why those don't work. But that's fine. Um. Try Mario Run. <laughs> Just to see. Yeah, I'm not obviously going into much detail about each app, <clears throat> but if it crashes before it loads, that's going to be problematic, and that's why I'm checking them. Um, Google Drive, I'm assuming this is going to work. Yep. It works. Um. worried about that one. I can't really try it without the controller for the drone. Um, Filmic Pro? That's another paid app. I'm assuming is pretty popular. Has it crashed? Cool. Got my little audio meter right there. <laughs> hello, hello! Alright. What else? Okay, Hulu. Well, not logged in to Hulu right now, but didn't crash. That's good news. I so far have not found anything that's crashed except for Waze, which may have just been a slow start. Ooh, battery life. Oh, that's an old app, I guess. I guess you don't need that anymore because it's built into it. So, interesting. One of my favorites is Ghost Pop. This is a fun, fun game. Oh, I haven't showed you the... Um... Okay, so this is... Uh... This is the new music app, which is awesome looking in, um, in dark mode, right? Okay. Um, the new volume HUD, I know everyone's trying to 
see what, how it looks. Um, <clears throat> if you hit it once, it's a big fat one, just like this one. And then you can change it yourself. If you don't want to do that, you can push it twice and it turns from a big fat one to a skinny one. You can adjust it like that. And from here, if you want to grab it and change it yourself, you can. Which is pretty cool. So that's what it looks like. Now you know. Um, I don't know what else to show you. So far, everything's working for me. I'm trying RTA. This is a real time. Ooh! The real time analyzer did not pass! <laughs> the real time analyzer. <clears throat> I use that for work sometimes. I used it today. Um, it's just an EQ graph with an SPL meter, sound pressure level in decibels, tell you how loud stuff is. That's going to be built into the new watch. Um, I'm sure that'll come out with an update soon. Hmm, that's the first one that just won't even open. <laughs> that's actually funny. I don't know why. Um, Google Photos. Yep. That's uh, working. Cool, cool. Um, oh, we've got to try Barbie. <laughs> Might be a little buggy with the volume. I think I turned it up already. Oh, that just crashed. You see that? <laughs> Let's try it again. We got two crashes now. Yeah, wow. Can't play Barbie for a while. That sucks. <laughs> TikTok? This is a popular video app. It's it's kind of it's super weird too, by the way. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, there you go. I just wanted to show you my radar. I don't know what are like super popular apps. These are just ones that I assume are popular and you'd be curious about. Dunwoody right now. Oh, it's like, what are those little dots? It's wind, I think. It's wind. Yeah, okay. Anyway, <laughs> there you have it. Um, that is everything I can think to show you. Um, like I have to always say, um, if it's your main daily driver and you're super worried about it, don't update yet. The public beta will probably be a lot more stable. Um, but for me, curiosity took over and I had to do it. And honestly, it's uh, kind of surprised me how well everything works. I love dark, the new dark mode. That's the reason I did it, mainly. Um, so for me, I'm happy I did it. And I will continue to play with it. And I will keep you updated as things progress. Thanks for watching. This is Dave, and we'll see you soon.